I just want to tell my story a little bit. So, uh, you know, I grew up in Houston. Um, in, in school, I wasn't really the best student. I was a straight C student, average. Um, and um, I really didn't know what I wanted to do in life. Like, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. My sister, she'd been wanting to do hair ever since she was seven. And growing up with somebody that knew what they wanted to do, knew, felt like they had a purpose in life, kind of makes you feel some type of way, like you don't know where the direction that you're going in. So after high school, I went to college for two years, and I just stopped, and I was just like, God, like, what, what am I here for? I, I see the things that I'm doing, the way that I'm leading my life is not taking me in the direction that I need to go in. So where, where is it that you want me to go? And I started to ask that question of where, what is my purpose? What am I here on this earth to do? And I started to study that, and I realized that your purpose is already inside of you. See, God created everyone here to solve a problem. There's a problem that everybody is here to solve. So what I decided to do, I took my struggles, I took my pain, the pain of not knowing not, not knowing what you want to do in life, and I studied that, and now I teach that to others. If you want to find your purpose, if you want to know the reason why you were created, if, just an example, uh, if you think of an iPhone, if, I, if you've never heard, seen an iPhone or whatever the case is, you, you just used to block phones. But I put an iPhone in front of you, you just like, what is this? I don't know what it is. And I tell you it's a cell phone. You're like, okay, I know what to do with it. But then when you know why it was created, you can fully maximize the potential of that thing. So it is not until that you know why, what something is and why it was created that you can fully maximize the potential of that thing. So if you want to find your purpose, you gotta ask yourself a few questions. You gotta know who you are. And a lot of times when you ask yourself who you are, you, you give me your name. I didn't ask what your name was, I asked who you are. You are a spirit being. So then you gotta ask the ne next question, what is your source? So now that you're a spirit being, you know who your source is, you know who to go to. And if the maker, the creator of you, knows exactly why he created you, you go to him to find out why you were created. So you go to God, find out what you created to do, and then you serve it to others. So the first thing if you want to find your purpose is you got to know who you are. Second thing is you got to go to your source. And the third thing, you got to serve it to others.